please welcome Director, Corporate Communications, Subaru of America, Michael McHale. Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to Subaru. I think we in this room appreciate more than most. It's been a pretty turbulent time for the industry lately, right? But whatever's been thrown at us, whether the, the disasters have been economic or natural, somehow we at Subaru have come out of them selling more cars than ever before. And now as we approach 2012, we're entering a new and exciting phase of our growth with new models on the horizon that will bring more customers than ever to our brand. Now we have a lot to look forward to in 2012, including two very important new Subaru models that we think you and our customers are going to love. And here to tell you more about what we are excited about is Subaru Chief Operating Officer, Mr. Tom Dahl. Tom, welcome. Thank you, Michael. Good afternoon and happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Today, I'm going to talk to you about three things. First, where Subaru has been. Second, where we are now. And third, where we're going in the next 12 months. Okay, first, where we've been and what have we been up to lately? Well, you might remember that in the last three years, while a lot of turmoil has hit the industry, we've been quietly setting records as the only manufacturer to post sales increases in three straight years. Our success was built on a product offensive that started with the 2008 Impreza, followed by an all-new WRX and STI, and then Forrester, Legacy, and Outback introductions in successive years. Those car lines formed a new generation of products, and our customers love them. So much so that we've set sales records for each of our product lines and record sales for Subaru of America. The formula was simple. We gave consumers world-class products, a customer-centric marketing experience, and a great dealer experience to match it. And we ticked the boxes customers cared about, boxes that we're pretty proud of ourselves, boxes like outstanding safety with top safety picks from the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety as the only maker with all of its models tested as top safety picks. We ticked the box for best value for money in the industry. We've always won the highest awards from ALG and Kelly Blue Book for our industry-leading residual and resale values. In fact, Subaru has won the coveted ALG Award for Best Mainstream Brand for three consecutive years. We always take the box for all-wheel drive performance and reliability, with 97% of Subarus built in the last 10 years still on the road. And of course, the box for love, with among the highest customer loyalty figures in the business. And as you may have read, our success wasn't built on incentives. In fact, according to industry analysts, our incentives on a year-to-date basis are the lowest in the industry. Now, our success was built on great vehicles at solid price points and backed by a brand people connect with. So because of all that, we entered 2011 in a very strong position, and we carried that strong position through, through the first quarter of the year, where our sales were up 14% as we continued to outpace the industry. Then, of course, as we all know, the earthquake and tsunami hit Japan and affected production of all Japanese manufacturers and many international auto manufacturers. What this meant for Subaru is that we ran our inventory levels down to record lows as we struggled to meet the still very strong consumer demand for our products. But now I'm very happy to say that we're back up and running. In fact, we have plans to produce more cars over the next six months than in any previous six-month period in our history. And so, even with the difficulties we've had this summer, we have such strong expectation for November and December sales that we should close the year with our second best sales year ever, and with a little luck, and if things go as planned, maybe even a new sales record for Subaru. Last year, we delivered a record 263,820 cars to Subaru customers. And we think that we can equal or beat this this year. And with more customers coming to the brand, if we can get enough cars to our dealers to set that record, this will mean that Subaru will be the only manufacturer in the industry to record four straight years of growth. That's truly a fantastic effort by the entire Fuji Heavy Industries, Subaru of America, distributor, and our dealer team. And that's not all. 
Next year, with our 2012 products arriving at dealers in numbers, we predict a new level of sales for Subaru. In fact, the next big breakthrough in sales, 300,000 units, is a very reachable target for our brand. And that would mean we would have been close to doubling our sales of people buying Subaru in just five years. Now, our confidence is based to a large part on the all new 36 mile per gallon 2012 Subaru Impreza. With its beautiful new styling, practicality, five star safety, driving performance and fuel economy, it's a car that will put Subaru square into the compact sedan segment. And at 36 miles per gallon fuel efficiency, which is standard on the CVT transmission, by the way, it's pretty significant. Because it means that Impreza is the most fuel efficient all wheel drive car in America. And guess what car is in second place? The Legacy 2.5. That's a pretty good one two punch for any car maker to have. The new Impreza is reaching Subaru dealers this month. Fresh reports have been extremely positive, and consumer interest in this car is at record levels. In fact, we already have over 3,000 sold orders in the bank, and we're predicting great things indeed for Impreza next year. So that brings me to where we are today. On the stand behind me, we're very proud to show you a look into our future with the BRZ concept, STI. While we have shown you the boxer engine rear-wheel drive chassis of the BRZ at previous auto shows, this concept is the first time we've shown you a sheet metal version of the BRZ sports car. And since we were showing you a concept, we thought we'd have a little fun by showing you an STI concept. And it's a stunning design that, exciting as it is, isn't too far away from the production model. The BRZ concept shows in dramatic fashion the engineering soul that will be a key feature of the production model, a soul that only Subaru could develop. The production BRZ has been engineered around the philosophy of pure handling delight. Our engineers have developed BRZ to be the best handling, lightweight sports car in the world. With a direct injection boxer engine, an unprecedented low center of gravity, and a brand new platform that features a lightweight yet stiff chassis, it is pure sports car from the ground up. Ladies and gentlemen, no other company but Subaru could have engineered such a pure, balanced, fun to drive car as BRZ. The production BRZ will debut on November 30th at the Tokyo Motor Show. And the BRZ will go on sale in the United States in the spring of 2012. BRZ takes Subaru into a new, younger market segment. And we're very excited to bring this exceptional model to the United States.